Hello, welcome to GTEC Solutions. Today we are going to discuss about volume and surface area. What is meant by volume and surface area? The total capacity of a shape can be volume and the surface area is the total area. Let us see the volume and the surface area of certain figures. Let us see the volume of a cuboid. A cuboid is nothing but the three dimensional form of a rectangle. Yes, it has a length, a breadth and a height as you can see. So the volume is the capacity of the cuboid. It can be found out using the formula L into B into H cubic units. The surface area of the cuboid is nothing but the area of six rectangles which can be calculated by using the formula 2 into LB plus BH plus LH square units. The diagonal of a cuboid can be obtained by using the formula square root of L square plus B square plus H square units. Moving on to cube. Cube is nothing but a three dimensional structure of a square. Just like square, the length will be same on all sides. Let the length be A. Then the volume of the cube can be calculated by using a cube that is you are multiplying your sides thrice a into a into a the surface area of a cube is the area of six squares hence six a square units Next, we have the diagonal of a cube. This is found out using the formula 3a, where a is the side of the cube. Moving on, we have cylinder. A cylinder is a shape that has a radius and a height. The volume of the cylinder is nothing but the capacity of the cylinder is given by the formula pi r square h cubic units. As you can see, it consists of two circles. We are just multiplying the circle's area with the height h pi r square into h. The curved surface area of a cylinder is the surface of the cylinder. It is calculated by using the formula 2 pi r into h, just like a circle. 2 pi r into h. The total surface area of a cylinder is nothing but curved surface area plus the surface area of two circles. It is obtained by the formula 2 pi r into h plus r square units. Moving on, we have sphere. Sphere has a radius, as you already know. Let us represent the radius using the symbol R. Then, the volume or the capacity of the sphere is given by the formula 4 by 3 pi r cube cubic units. The surface area of the sphere can be calculated by using the formula 4 pi r square square units. Moving on, we have our next shape that is hemisphere. Clearly, we know that hemisphere is a sphere that is cut into half. So, it has a radius as r and it has a curved surface area and a total surface area. So, to find the volume of a hemisphere, we have 2 by 3 pi r cube cubic units. 
that is half the volume of a sphere the curved surface area is calculated using the formula 2 pi r square square units hemisphere has a curved surface area that is calculated using this formula the total surface area is calculated using the formula 3 pi r square square units we should know that 1 liter is nothing but 1000 centimeter cube which is used to find the capacity of a liquid that can be filled in a hemispherical bowl.